It's Batista. The following contest is a triple threat extreme rules match. Making his way to the ring from Washington, D.C. Weighing in at 290 pounds, the animal. We can list this man's accolades all day long. A former WWE Champion, a Royal Rumble winner, a man who has main evented WrestleMania. And now Batista simply demands that the WWE Universe give him what he wants. Six foot six, 295 pounds, all animal. We've seen that when the beast is unleashed, nobody can stop Batista. Championships, main events, Batista will take them by force. And gentlemen, tonight the animal is on the hunt for even more. One of the most prolific competitors in WWE history. Without question, a man who has exhibited over 25 years of dominance in sports entertainment. And that dominance will continue before our very eyes tonight. And his opponents first from Greenwich, Connecticut, weighing in at 255 pounds, the game, Triple H. We are moments away from a true exhibition of authority. In the ring, he commands respect. He's a technical mastermind. Triple H has seen it all. Triple H has done it all. And much like his nickname says, Triple H is always at the top of his game. Triple H is always the one in control. Knows how to pull his opponent's strings. Yeah, once the game gets inside your head, it's pretty much all over. We are about to see a methodical dissection, courtesy of the Cerebral Assassin. from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 286 pounds. He is the World Heavyweight Champion, the Beast, Brock Lees R. The Beast. The Beast, the Conqueror, the Mayor of Suplex City. Brock Lesnar has earned every nickname bestowed upon him. The most decorated combat athlete in the world, gracing WWE with his presence. Someone's gonna take a trip to Suplex City. Yeah, that's almost guaranteed. Brock Lesnar is ready for a fight.
And now it's time to get extreme, extreme rules match underway. No disqualifications, no countouts. This is where we really get to see the violent creativity of superstars. Well, that's because sometimes a straight-up wrestling match isn't enough, Cole. Sometimes you need a few accessories to incapacitate your opponent. Be it a kendo stick, a chair, or a table, the possibilities are endless. Well, timely counter by Lesnar. Being carried around with ease. Face Buster plants him. Into a German. I do not see this match going on much longer with too many more moves like that from them. You have got to be in elite physical condition to pull off something like that. Nice suplex. German! Just pure dominance. Boom, what a kick. Oh, no. And he goes into the ring. Lesnar moved. Big forearm. A defensive elbow to the gut ends that. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. An uncanny showing of power. It might not be flashy, but sometimes you just got to toss another person to make a statement. Given the no disqualification modifier on this match, Corey, what kind of tactics should you expect to see here? Ruthless tactics, Cole. Now is the time for these superstars to unleash their pent-up aggression and be as violent as they want. There's nothing the ref can do about it, so they should go all out. What's he open to find down there? And a, Ooh, his shoulders are down. He kicks out instantly. This isn't even close to over. Sure, he's pumping himself up, but he's also giving his opponent a chance to recover. Into the ring now. He's been placed in the corner now. Batista looking a little less sure of himself than he usually does. This is certainly not what he wants. Yeah, Lesnar's just having fun out there at this point. Oh, man, right to the esophagus. Illegal in many sports, but that was used effectively in there. Close line. Turned that one around. He's got something coming. Just breaking down the opponent. Is it enough here? And quick getting the arm up. Maybe that was just to keep his opponent off balance. This isn't the smartest thing to do. Antagonizing your opponent instead of attacking him. Oh, he knew exactly what he was looking for when he started digging under the apron. No one just finds a sledgehammer. Out thinking the cerebral assassin. And here comes Old Faithful. The steel chair is in hand. Great power. Inverted suplex. They're lining up their opponent. What do they have in mind? Ooh, a well placed he dropped to the skull. I don't know what they're looking for here. WWE Universe wants tables. Well, they've got tables. Triple H balanced himself up top. Flying. Diving hammer strike. And some strain coming to Lesnar after that maneuver. Part of the territory when you're in an extreme rules match, Cole. Oh my gosh, with one hand. I don't think people realize the amount of strength it takes to hurl someone like that. Uh-oh, capture driven into the knee. Tag with a punch. He's looking to take this fight to a whole new level. He climbs into the ring. Put into the corner now. Bang! The adrenaline is pumping, and the WWE Universe is on his side. Side slam. Lesnar looking to bait his opponent into making a mistake. He is truly feeling it right now, as well he should. Ooh, chuck that chair right at him. And I think it is clear that Brock Lesnar is feeling the physicality of this matchup. 
Not what you want to see by any means. Right now, Brock needs to find the form that has made him a dominant force. Oh, countering with a chop block will halter any attack. We are witnessing a malicious string of attacks right now. Batista with the Batista bomb! Batista got all of him. Reversal! Can he take advantage? Triple H with the counter. And a clothesline. Batista is feeding off the WWE Universe. Coming back into the ring, back to the action. Ooh. Right to the kidneys. Oh, Brox. Oh, this should have been over, but he breaks the hold. And he heads out of the ring. No count outs, no worries. He clearly has dangerous intentions in mind here, gentlemen. And he barely evades. Boom, running STO plants him. Nicely done. I've got to say, the amount of punishment we've seen in the match would have already ended most superstars. The level of resilience we're seeing is off the charts. Measuring. Oh, face stop. Momentum moving towards Batista's corner. But I doubt there's any panic seeping into Brock's mind. Whoa, they just chucked that hammer right at him. He gets back into the ring. Oh, takes a big clean hit from the table. What in the world? That's a hammer. You can't just throw a hammer. Oh, Brock Lesnar may break the arm. Come on, lock applied. And you he doesn't yeah. have much time before his arm snaps. Great job fighting out. Boom, running STO plants him. Nicely done. And Lesnar can't stop any offense coming his way. Yeah, Batista with impressive offense. To the outside. Is, we got a cover. Yeah, no, he doesn't get the three. How in the world did he kick out? Capitalizes against the game. Continuing to attack the neck across the top rope. Climbs back inside. Avoids contact and... Batista with a patented Batista bomb. That could be curtains for Brock. Cover. Two. And he's still in the game. The scary thing is, this is ordinary for the Beast Incarnate. It's going to take a lot more to keep Lesnar down for the count. And Batista visibly frustrated now as he's not being given what he wants. The animal just might be unleashed as a result of the aggravation. And my word, this has been a match for the ages. This has been a monumental affair. He's setting up the table in the corner. This isn't going to be good. This doesn't even look like trying to win a match anymore. This looks like trying to end someone's career. Oh, the knee takes a big hit. The animal is being unleashed. Triple H is lacking his trademark intensity. Wielding the sledgehammer, clearly feeling the power that comes with it. The universal signal for extreme. The kendo stick has entered the fray. He could pin his opponent right here. the shoulder up after two. I am shaking my head in disbelief over how he managed to get the shoulder up. Oh, man, I'm not liking the look of this. He switches it back around. So confident is Batista. He thinks he's got this one all set. Great trouble here. Can he get it fully locked in? Ah, uh, hammer lock applied. The game. Ah, oh, this one should have been over. Batista with the Batista bomb. Well, that proved to be enough this time. Two. And 
gets the win, beating the odds in this triple threat. And here's a look back at some of the action from the previous match. Here is your winner, the Animal Batista! The WWE Universe showing appreciation as all three competitors after an amazing triple threat match. Yeah, it may sound cliche, but you have to keep your head on a swivel in a match like this. And our winner did just that.